Well, welcome into the live music showcase here on WMNF. And from the Mike Eisenstadt Performance Studio, we're going to be playing you music for the next 55 minutes here. Brought to you by WMNF. I'm Bill Dudley. I'm your host for the next uh, the next minutes. And today on the show, we got a great band. They're performing tonight and this weekend also. And I'll tell you all about that. They're the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. They were on our show one time before, way back a long time ago. And we're going to let them start off with a tune. What's this first one going to be, guys? This is called Lost Highway. Good luck, everybody. up this morning, hit the high water mark, being tired of living in the fog and in the dark. I didn't go to work, I couldn't handle the jive, gotta find better reasons for staying alive. I Gonna hit the high road Gonna get out of town Before my conscience explodes Gonna find that lost highway I know it's out there somewhere Take it back to the garden On two things and a prayer I will. Lost time 
You got them. They're here live in the studio here at WMNF. It's the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. And uh, doing some outrageous music for you today. Hey, let's introduce the guys and gals in this band. We on accordion and vocals and a bunch of other instruments. We've got Tink Lloyd. Welcome to the studio once again. My pleasure. We've got uh, Sharky McEwen. That's the man who was doing that outrageous guitar <laughs> stuff on that last <laughs> Thanks, Bill. He's just sort of an outrageous guy all the way around. And then uh, doing the vocals and rhythm guitar on this band, we got J- Josiah Longo. Hey, Josiah, welcome back. Thank you, Bill. Good to be back. We figured back. you guys were on like in 2011 or something like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah I think it was 2011. Yeah, yeah. Now, also, uh, so let's, let's tell them where you're going to be playing so they can start making plans now. Well, we're, we're doing, uh, we're playing Riverhawk tomorrow. We're doing that festival, uh-huh, uh, yeah. big Riverhawk festival, which we had a really good time playing last time we were in. And we're also playing um, tonight in Fogartyville. We're doing a show. Down in beautiful David Sarasota. David Beaton and those guys at yeah, SLR. You that'll know, be great, so too. That should be good. Yeah. And then we're doing something else in St. Augustine. Uh-huh. Yeah, on Sunday. On yeah. Sunday. These guys know more than me. I'm, yeah. I'm well, the mouthpiece, but well, I don't have a brain Well, a lot engaged. of people will probably be coming out to Riverhawk also. Cool, cool. And uh, for those of you that have never been to that festival, uh, it's, it's a lot of fun, but it's, uh, it's not as far away as you might think. The address is Brooksville, but it's not anywhere near Brooksville. <laughs> let me just say that. It's right off of I-75, and uh, you just go to the second date city exit and get off there. It's pretty, pretty straightforward. It doesn't take that long to get to. So don't be intimidated by the fact that the address of the thing is Brooksville, because Brooksville is a long way away. But this is very nice, and it's a lovely festival. I was out there last night hanging out, hearing some folks, and there were a lot of, a lot of people there. So we, the last time we were here in this studio, we were at Riverhawk. Yeah. That's you, when you, that, yeah. You so. came back here to do the show, right, mm-hmm. yeah. Well, it's great to have you back again. And uh, all, also, you'll be joined by Eric uh, Puente. On, that's your drummer. Yeah, that's right. And he's not here today, but he'll be there on the shows tonight and tomorrow. It kicks a greater level of butt when the drummer's in the <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, let's have another tune, if you please. So th- this is a song that's dedicated to people like Sid Barrett, who couldn't quite make it through the 60s. <laughs> uh, it's called Very Unusual Head. <laughs> Very unusual head. He's got a very unusual head. They will take him apart when he's dead. In his very unusual head. Cause he's sorry to poor and predictable games that they play. With a glorious noise that can steal all our sad hearts away. Up through the atmosphere, very unusual head Got a very unusual head They will take him apart when he's dead And his very unusual head Yeah, they're following, swallowing everything he's got to say But he's wallowing, hollow and bare But he's coming back again Ducks in a row He's preambling, gambling This time the whole thing will go Straight through the atmosphere Got a very unusual head He's got a very unusual head they will take him apart when he's dead And his very unusual head Everyone 
sing along very unusual head got a very unusual head they will take him apart when he's dead and his very unusual head one more time got a very unusual head got a very unusual head they will take him apart when he's dead and it's very unusual head Surely take him apart when he's dead And it's very unusual head <laughs> The Slambovian Circus of Dreams, an aptly named band performing live here in our studios at WMNF Mixed Up Today by sound virtuoso Mr. Mark Perfetti. Today he's assisted by Maggie Tobin. And we got our great video crew, Richard Stone, Marcy Connors, Tom Connors, Michaela Williams, and uh, John Casimiro. Steve Arduango produces our show today, and uh, Mildred Matos is the associate producer of the Live Music Showcase. If you have any reactions or questions or anything, you can give us a call on the studio line at 813-239-9663. That's 239-WMNF. But you know what? We are really hoping to get a couple of calls from people who love live music and want to help us meet our goal in the late, great fall fundraising festival. We still have to make up a few bucks, and so we've got some great tickets and things like that. We're offering as thank you gifts for people that call us just during this hour that our show is on. I'll tell you what, we got one pair of uh, tickets for the Riverhawk Festival, but you got to pick them up here at the radio station. One pair of tickets. And only one pair left for a $100 pledge to WMNF. If you can come down here and pick them up and pay your pledge, that would be really great. And uh, there's two in it. There's uh, an afternoon, a night, and two more days left to the festival, so it, it'll be great. We have a pair of single-day tickets to the festival for uh, an $80 pledge. We've also got a pair of tickets to Damien Rice, and that's coming up November 9th at Tampa Theater. Those tickets will be uh, will call, but that is a sold-out concert. You can get a pair of tickets to Damien Rice for an $80 pledge if you give us a call right now. And uh, those are will call tickets, but nobody else can get in because it's sold out. We've got one pair. And if you call us during the show here with an $80 pledge, you can grab those tickets. Also got a pair of tickets to the Slambovians tonight in Fogartyville for a $40 pledge and comes with an autographed CD. Wow, that's a great deal, huh? So, somebody want to tell me where you came up with the name, and uh, it, it just seems to be a great name for what you, you all do, and wow. the way you look. Thank you. <laughs> I just posted a picture of you all right here. And, <laughs> and they could see us on the radio, right? Yeah, these well, days. well, soon. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, the name came, we, we, you know, we were in New York City, we were in New York City studio musicians that moved up river. We <laughs> moved to Sleepy Hollow, you know. Is that a real place? Up on the Hudson. Yeah. Oh man! I and I was wa- I used to walk through the woods by the graveyard where all the Van Tassels are buried and stuff. You know, from the from old the, aristocracy. Yes, all that stuff. And uh, the name Gandalf Murphy and the Slambovian Circus of Dreams, which was our kind of like our baptismal name that we shortened, right? Was uh, just came to me in a flash. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I went back and told the band. I thought it was funny, and you know, I had written it down on my little index card, and they all loved it. And we tried it; figured it would last a few months, you know, as a, <laughs> and it lasted our whole career. We were like very rich. How long ago was sports that? Sports cars and everything. That was a uh, man. Ninety-eight, maybe. Ninety-eight. Okay, wow. Seventeen. Yeah, we years survived ago. just doing this, you know. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, so you all tra- you travel all around? Yeah, that we do. We, we've been we've been on an endless tour. We do about two or three of the UK, and then we'll. Go to the West Coast a little bit. We're based, you know, still in right on the Hudson in the Hudson Highlands now. So you got right? a beautiful place to come back to. There. Yeah, we do. It keeps us sane. You know, that really helps. <laughs> we're in, we're in the, in the mountains right on the Hudson River. It's very beautiful. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. So the Slambovian Circus of Dreams, our our guests on today's show, and uh, we're going to let them do another tune. We'll come back and try to find out more about these these folks. Speaking of where we live, you know, we're, we're, we're right up the road where, from where Pete Seeger used to live. So he used to pull us in to do all these fundraisers for the folk realm. God, I can, I can just see that. Pete Seeger and you guys. I yeah. Bet, I we bet fit he, very I well I bet he together. loved you guys. Yeah, yeah. 
we, we, we got along well, but we had to make sure we did enough like sissy folk songs so that they would hire us for the folk <laughs> you, festival. You mean like 500 miles? Or something? <laughs> yes, you know, you know those. Avoiding things like Tom Dooley, which really caused a lot of uh, mental problems for kids, you know. But uh, we're going to do a, on the something on the sissy end, see if we could pull it off right now. Oh, is this Baby where you Jane. do Puff the Magic Dragon? No, no. Yes, it is. <laughs> Puff the Magic Dragon. Well, uh, Noel, Noel Paul Stuckey was here. And Paul was he, here, right? And yeah. he made us all sing that. Did he? Good. On the air. I had to sing Puff the Magic Dragon. Good. We really love that song, even oh, though we I don't our like cooler that side song. doesn't let us get away with that <laughs> it's stuff. It's too sad. It is very sad, isn't it? Yes, it is. Devastating. As most folk songs are, I find. <laughs> well, it reflects life, then. This one's, okay. this is a... Even our folk songs are kind of posery folk songs, so this is kind of like the singer-songwriter sensitive end of things. Anyway, this is another song that came down in one piece. We always dedicate it to the invincible spirit of women. It's called Baby Jane. See if we can play it. If not, we'll stop and do something more ham-fisted. Here we go. There are things they try to sell What they're worth I cannot tell We spend so much time Just surviving We let heaven go to hell You gotta move on, baby Jane Way they think will make you go insane To steal your love and then slam your name Well that's alright They cannot steal your light Yeah they can never steal your light Move on, baby Jane. So move on, baby Jane. His face is strong, his words are sweet. Specifically honed to knock you off your feet. Knock you down there, hold you under anything to keep you incomplete. You gotta move on, baby Jane, to steal your love and then slam your name. He's terrified you're gonna stake your claim Yeah, he fears your soul But he's no longer in control Yeah, he's no longer in control So you just move on Stop here, oh. we 
we'll start sinking. We gotta move until we get it right. We gotta move on, baby Jane. The way they think will make you go insane. Steal your love and then slay your name Cause you're so fine I wish that you were mine That was beautiful, you guys. <laughs> Thank you, Bill. Thank yeah, you. I enjoyed that. Thank you. Wow. I'm sure we what can pull great, that off. What a great... And now, is that one on, on one of the albums? Yeah, that's an early song. That's for, that's an, like an ancient kind of Murphy song. From, I think it's on the first album of Good Thief Tips' His Hat album. Isn't okay. It? Flapjacks from the Sky, I believe. Oh, it's from Flapjacks from the Sky, our second album. I believe. Okay. Okay, we we just released the greatest hits that no one knows album too. That's got all of them covered. It's called a box of everything in case that sounds good. Online. Yeah. And and that'll be one of the uh, that's part of one of our thank you gifts if folks call up uh, at eight one three two three nine nine six six three. Which I forgot to give that number after giving the big spiel about the thank you gifts. I forgot to give the phone number. So it's eight one three two three nine nine six six three or DJ at WMNF dot org. If you want to support live music today, presenting the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. They're all the way down here from upstate New York, playing music for you and singing gorgeous stuff like that last one, which uh, they do all kinds of things. And they, like I said, their name is really, really fits them. They're uh, interesting looking folks, and uh, they, they play a lot of interesting instruments, and uh, they're very interesting folks. That's, uh, I'm going to leave it at that. That's the polite <laughs> thing to say. Thank you. Thank you. But we do have, we do have some uh, Riverhawk tickets where they're going to be appearing tomorrow uh, for a $100, $100 pledge for a pair of tickets for the whole weekend, mm-hmm. the whole remaining Riverhawk weekend. There's a lot of music still left. Hey, if people make a pledge, they can come be our crew all weekend. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> and and a single pair of, of, of a pair of single day tickets that is for an eighty dollar mm. pledge if you call us right now, and also uh, a pair of tickets to only one pair left to Damian Rice November 9th at Tampa Theater, which is a sold out concert, and that's for an eighty dollar pledge. If you want to give us a call here to help us make up our shortfall on last month's fundraising thing. So we'd love to hear from you at 813-239-9663. I'm Bill Dudley, and Mark Perfetti is mixing it up today. And uh, we've got the Slambovian Circus of Dreams on the air. Uh, The fellow who was singing, Josiah Longo. Josiah, what's your background in music? Did you grow up a folky? You know, I grew up. The first song I ever learned was Hang Down Your Head, Tom Dooley. You know, my father played and my grandfather played, but it just happened to be that that was like a hit at the particular time. I'm pretty ancient. 1957. You know? Yeah, was it 57? Yeah. yeah so. that was the, well, well, that's the song that started the folk scare. It was, right? Yeah, yeah. it was. Yeah. That song messed me up for Million years. Million selling I mean. song, it was actually a folk song. I had to do. I had to join a death metal band to erase that murderous song from my brain. <laughs> and did you uh, succeed? In <laughs> we shouldn't even be talking about this. <laughs> <laughs> Pete used to get. A, I mean, we would all do. Do mind. your Iron Maiden stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah. I mean, uh, my dad played. My grandfather played. So I, I grew up doing Hank Williams, mm-hmm. like all the old timey country stuff. And then the British invasion happened. So the band is still a combination of like 
prison folk music and uh, you know uh, British invasion. I think we're kind of that's kind of what, where we fit right in the middle of those two yeah. things. Pretty good. So. Well, uh, also in the band Sharky McEwen. Sharky, how'd you uh, get connected with with all of this? I grew up in L.A. and. Uh, well, that explains a lot. So, yeah. and then I met these guys. Yes. So, no. <laughs> he was doing all those bands out there. I did a bunch of bands out there, and then I moved out to New York in the '90s and uh, started working at a studio where these guys were, you know, had a band and were doing things there. And I just kind of hooked up with them, and uh, it took off from there. Wow. That's the simple story. What, <laughs> what's your background in this music? Did you play rock and roll originally? Um, yeah, yeah, I played, I played rock and roll, kind of like a little bit psychedelic rock kind of stuff when I first started playing when I was a teenager and then you know I was in cover bands I did all kinds of stuff country music uh, all around guy. jazz but stuff his, you know his brother program with Dwayne Allman quite yeah kind of I was really definitely little. influenced by you know the Allman Brothers and yeah. Jimi Hendrix and all those classic kind of things back then wow but uh, yeah and I yeah. do want to say that Sharky has some Louisiana roots and I think that's why he's just got the most graceful hands when he plays I think it's that <laughs> slow hand is, is Thanks, not Tim. even the best <laughs> description he's just got these amazing hands when this he plays so that's great <laughs> well that's 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 the voice of Tink Lloyd and Tink's playing today she's playing cello on that last tune and also and, accordion and I forgot to turn on the cello lucky you <laughs> <laughs> I, th I thought it was fairly muted, uh, but I thought it was part of the arrangement. It, it, it sounded good, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she plays everything. Well, she hopefully stir. she'll play it again, folks. What's your story, Tink? How'd you get mixed up with this crew? Well, what's really bizarre is, um, so I am I have an Irish heritage, and so, you know, it's kind of like from when I was like just a little, a little tyke, I remember asking for a harp for Christmas, and everybody laughed at me. You know, it's just my hands have always been itching to play things, and so... It's kind of in the blood. My dad actually played accordion, and I just had this uh, epiphany and started playing the accordion in the, in the, in this band, you know. Um, but just to say, like Josiah and I, you know, we were married and we did a few projects before we started working with Shark. But nothing was as great as this. I was just telling them this morning, this is the best thing that I've ever done in my life. First well, band well, we don't get in fist fights. Eh? <laughs> That's really great. I, it's really good when a band doesn't get in fist fights, you know. That's We've gone through a lot of pillows, though. It's really yeah. desirable. It's okay. <laughs> well, also in the band, Eric Puente, he's going to be with you on the show tonight at Fogartyville and then this weekend at the Great Big Riverhawk Festival. Yeah. yeah. How about another tune? Yeah. This we'll play something on the ham fist at end of things with Eric. This thing really kicks butt. But this is um. You have to imagine that it kicks butt. <laughs> yeah. We, we have to. Uh, yeah. We 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 would ask that you could uh, employ the imaginary drummer in your mind for these song songs. We would appreciate it. Yeah. We'll, we'll just do that. But uh, this is problem. called Moon Dog House. You gonna start it, Chuck? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Till our feet 
leave the ground and the light Break through the darkest places Some people go to church on Sunday kneel and pray Well, I say God bless them if they can go that way But me, I have to wait until the sun goes down Go to my holy shack on the edge of town I try to spend my days doing all I can To help my fellow woman and my fellow man But when the sun goes down I start getting blue I like to spend my time Being alone with you And we dance Like the trees in a storm in the night Sweet romance Till the stars all bow down to our light I never want to come down Bop dee bop dee bop ho Skibbe dee bop dee bop dee bop ho Skibbe dee 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 Yeah we dance Like the fleas on a dog in the night yeah, we dance Till our feet leave the ground in the light Break through the darkest places This is, this is great music, folks. This is the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. They're our band today on the WMNF Live Music Showcase. We're happy to have them here after uh, about, uh, I don't know, four or five years. They were here ago. They were here, and, uh, and they're back. They're at, uh, at Riverhawk Festival and at Fogartyville tonight and playing live in the studio, being mixed up today by Mark Profetti, his very own self, assisted by... Maggie Tobin, and we got our video crew, Richard Stone, Marcy and Tom, the Connors family, Michaela Williams, and John Casimiro. Steve Arduango is our show producer, and he uh, actually is uh, in the control room right now. If you want to give him a call, it's 813-239-9663, or send him an email at dj at wmnf.org. And uh, Steve is our show producer, associate producer of this radio show, Mildred Matos. And... Uh, you can check it out, check our show out on Facebook anytime you want. It's WMNF's Live Music Showcase, and you can also listen on the archive anytime you want. If you know the date of a past show, you can listen to that, too. And it's all happening for you right here at 88.5. <laughs> we've got, uh, we've got Tink Lloyd's picked up her recorder. Now, don't forget to turn that on. Yeah, i got to turn this thing on. Okay, flip that switch there. You know, when we were coming down here, we were saying, well, what can we do for our good friends at WMNF? Because this is like the first time we came to Florida, we did something with you guys. We played Heat Wave. That was our first thing. Oh, yeah, that's and right. Then, and then yeah. we and, and we know that you have such a refined audience. We're very refined. So yeah, we thought, it. you know, yeah, we yeah. thought we would play our more like ham-fisted stuff, but we thought we would just bring you some, a little bit of the artistic side experimental are you talking about the sensitive side of the <laughs> slambovian service <laughs> we, we only do one of those per set it's the slambovian <laughs> consort i see we, we're, we're changing into that right now we wrote a, we wrote a song about dolly that's called solve it all daily <laughs> and uh we're gonna we're gonna 
attempt to play that for you. It's brand new, so we don't know it. So it should be pretty good to okay. try to do on the radio for everyone. Might as well go out on a limb here on live radio, right? Why not? <laughs> this could be the end of our career or the beginning of the money coming in. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> the elephant's legs I bet it was you solve it all daily taught them to walk through the streets on stilted grey limbs like Barnum and Bailey you pulled a trick with the tigers too and now no one can keep them in the zoo why do you do what you do when you do what you do Solve it all daily. Well, who turned Narcissus to stone? Fishes to phones that always call me. And who melted all the town clocks and hung them on rocks and limbs by the blue sea? Who put those drawers in your sister's chest? Had to retail her favorite dress. Why do you make normal such a mess? What are you up to? Solve it all daily. Solve it all daily. Well, maybe behind that mustachioed mask a black hole sucking everything in making rules lose control deconstructing dogmatic distractions that rule our reason back to molecular dances and music of spheres that our ears used to hear before fig leaves and fear made us deaf dumb and blind to the beauty that really matters Solve it all. 
another lovely waltz from our band today on the Live Music Showcase. It's the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. The Slambovians are here in the studio live, and they're playing all this weekend at various venues, and we'll tell you all about that in just a second. They've got a website, slambovia.com, from the mystical, uh, mysterious, mythical place called Slambovia. And slambovia.com, where you can find out all about their albums and all their appearances and all that good stuff like that. Yes. So you're in, the, you're in the middle of the never-ending tour. Yeah. And we're happy to have you back. We're Thank actually, you. this is so cool because we're just finishing up the Box of Everything tour. These are the last few shows we're touring that album. Oh, okay. Before the holidays. And that's like a best of album. Yeah, it is. It's the best thing that you guys don't know yet. So <coughs> <laughs> how can you get it wrong? Yeah, and you, and you, you didn't want, you, you, it's sort of the unheard Slambovians. Yeah, well, yeah, sort of. <laughs> anyway, it's our greatest hits, and we just wanted to give everybody a chance to hear the best stuff before we release the new album, which is coming out next year. All right. You know, so. Yeah. yeah we Sony, had a new Sony's been bugging us for years, you know, since we left the city to do something with them. So this box of everything was their idea, you know, to release something together. All right. But they're slow pokes, you know. <laughs> they can't the do anything as fast big, as Big, big company. But anyway, so so where do the songs come from? Where do they come from? Yeah, I mean, do, who writes them? I, I, I write the word. I write the story part of them. Yeah, so okay. uh, they come from my uh, desperate need to escape from the darkness of my <laughs> of my mind. They're like ladders out for me. You know, a lot of times the songs are uh, they're kind of hopeful from a dark place kind of songs, but they just pop into my head. I, I write a lot of s too much stuff. I drive the band crazy. And how many albums of, of your stuff are there? A whole bunch. How many albums we got, Sharky? studio albums and a bunch of live things yeah something like that yeah, yeah. wow but uh but about five of them on the docket there's about five albums floating around wow we were we were, we were in the middle of writing a song for uh, an album for china we want to go back we were the first american band to get into china back in the day when no, there was only really? one hotel in shanghai wow. we were there. And you did it, you did a tour of China. Yeah, we did. We did a t tour back then. When, you know, when they carried guns at the shows. I mean, it was pretty volatile when we were there. You <laughs> Jeez. Know. Uh, people, when they go over now, they say, you got any places to, you know, where you would suggest we should go? <laughs> but w when we were there, it was like before they built the Great Wall, I think. So. <laughs> that so. goes back. That goes back away. Well, the, the Slambovians in our studio today, uh, that's Josiah Longo, who was just, just talking to you there. Uh, Sharky McEwen is here on uh, guitars, <laughs> playing some of his wonderful, uh, wonderful lead guitar. Sounds just like Dickie Betts sometimes. <laughs> Thanks. And Tink Lloyd is here, and she's switching back to accordion. Now, remember, turn that on. Yeah, I did. And uh, uh, playing a bunch of stuff. And at the shows tonight and tomorrow, uh, you'll hear Eric Puente also on drums and percussion filling out the sound of the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. Once again, if you're interested in uh, going to one of these shows, we've got some tickets. And you can call us right now on the studio request line at 813-239-9663. And, uh, whoops, I'm being handed a thing here. Oh, my goodness, we've got a whole bunch of people to thank. And I don't have to announce anything other than just to say Jessica in Sarasota, she's going to grab those uh, weekend tickets to Riverhawk. And uh, so that is history. Louise in Tampa made a pledge for an autographed CD. Right. And Joe in Winter Haven is going to go see Damien Rice. And we still have, the only thing we have left is tonight's tickets to Fogartyville. And that, uh, that's in Sarasota. And those are, uh, I imagine, those are wheel call tickets. And for a $40 pledge, you can go see them tonight. And check it out for yourself. And I think you'll, uh, I think you'll uh, be pleased by this band. They're, they're just a lot of fun. They're a lot of fun to hear. They're a lot of fun to see. And they look like they're having a pretty good time, which is really <laughs> great. We, are, we, are. we like it when the band looks like they're having a good time. Yeah. It's funny because we're nervous when we walk down the street normally. As soon as like we're on the radio or television, we relax. You just relax, reason. right? We Everything. don't function so well like going to the grocery <laughs> store. <laughs> <laughs> well then hurry up and do another tune <laughs> okay this this is an old one we're gonna do uh this is a favorite of a lot of people uh, uh it's called sunday in the rain i think it's from the flapjacks album That's right. Mm, right. Yeah. Yeah. 
Woke up today Like yesterday I went out to score some anti-pain But I need your voice Not something else on this Sunday in the rain Music from the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. And uh, I was reminded we still have a couple of tickets left for single-day Riverhawk tickets. $80 will get you a pair of single-day Riverhawk tickets if you call us right now at 813-239-9663. Those are tickets that have to be picked up right here at WMNF at 1210 East Martin Luther King Boulevard in Tampa. Bear that in mind. $80 for a set. We still have one or two sets of those tickets left for Riverhawk. And also tickets to Fogartyville. Tonight's show with the Slambovians still available for a $40 pledge. One pair of, for tonight at Fogartyville. Hey, hey, whoever hey, comes hey. to Fogarty, Fogartyville, 
I will give them our special Halloween T-shirt. We did a Halloween show last weekend, and we made these amazing shirts with Josiah's Dolly artwork that he created. So if they come to that show, I'll give them a T-shirt. Sounds great. I'm just saying. Well, guys, it's been great having you on the show today. I think we got time for one more tune, but i got to just do some quick things here. You've been listening to the Live Music Showcase. The station is WMNF Tampa. You can hear us anytime at WMNF.org. Today's show mixed by Mark Perfetti, assisted by Maggie Tobin. We've got our video crew, Richard Stone, Marcy and Tom Connors, Michaela Williams, and John Casimiro. Producer of this show, Steve Arduango. Mildred Mattis is our associate producer, and I'm Bill Dudley. And what's his last tune going to be? This thing is, uh, this is called the Translambovian Bipolar Express. Great. Oh, I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee. And I'm bound for Louisiana, my own true love for to say. Oh, it rained all night the day I left. The weather was bone dry. The sun so high, I froze to death. Susanna, don't you cry. Times I rode a train of light It kept me safe from harm It whispered, oh, my love Oh, my child, oh, my dream I will give you the life If you just give me the means on the train Hold on to the fears I know too well To where my demons fly It rolled right into hell And then that light shone out In that whistle
great love shot right through me Untangled all those feet That could like it always knew me Said, oh my child I'm always here And I awoke to this world we live in and it all seemed a joke in its logic wearing thin so I said hey come back let's make it in let's begin and if you help me out I will help Got them. They're here live in the studio here at WMNF. It's the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. And uh, doing some outrageous music for you today. Hey, let's introduce the guys and gals in this band. 
we on accordion and vocals and a bunch of other instruments. We've got Tink Lloyd. Welcome to the studio once again. My pleasure. We've got uh, Sharky McEwen. That's the man who was doing that outrageous guitar <laughs> stuff on that <laughs> last time. Thanks, Bill. He's just sort of an outrageous guy all the way around. And then uh, doing the vocals and rhythm guitar on this band, we got J- Josiah Longo. Hey, Josiah, welcome back. Thank you, Bill. Good to be back. We figured back. you guys were on like in 2011 or something like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah I, I think was it was 2011. Yeah, yeah. Now, also, uh, so let's, let's tell them where you're going to be playing so they can start making plans now. Well, we're, we're doing, uh, we're playing Riverhawk tomorrow. We're doing that festival, uh-huh, uh, yeah. big Riverhawk festival, which we had a really good time playing last time we were in. And we're also playing um, tonight in Fogartyville. We're doing a show. Down in beautiful David Sarasota. David Beaton and those guys at yeah, SLR. Yeah, that'll know, be great, so too. That should be good. Yeah. And then we're doing something else in St. Augustine. Uh-huh. Yeah, on Sunday. On yeah. Sunday. These guys know more than me. I'm, I'm well, the mouthpiece, but well, I don't have a brain Well, a lot engaged. of people will probably be coming out to Riverhawk also. Cool, cool. And yeah. uh, for those of you that have never been to that festival, uh, it's it's a lot of fun. But it's uh, it's not as far away as you might think. The address is Brooksville, but it's not anywhere near Brooksville. <laughs> let me just say that. It's right off of I-75. And uh, you just go to the second date city exit and get off there. It's pretty pretty straightforward. doesn't take that long to get to. So don't be intimidated by the fact that the address of the thing is Brooksville, because Brooksville is a long way away. But this is very nice, and it's a lovely festival. I was out there last night hanging out, hearing some folks, and there were a lot of, a lot of people there. So we, the last time we were here in the studio, we were at Riverhawk. Yeah, that's you, when you, that. Yeah, you so. came back here to do the show, right? Yeah. Well, it's great to have you back again. And uh, all, also, you'll be joined by Eric uh, Puente. On, that's your drummer. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. The Slambovian Circus of Dreams, an aptly named band performing live here in our studios at WMNF. Mixed up today by sound virtuoso Mr. Mark Perfetti. Today he's assisted by Maggie Tobin. And we got our great video crew, Richard Stone, Marcy Connors, Tom Connors, Michaela Williams, and... Uh, John Casimiro. Steve Arduango produces our show today, and uh, Mildred Matos is the associate producer of the Live Music Showcase. If you have any reactions or questions or anything, you can give us a call on the studio line at 813-239-9663. That's 239-WMNF. But you know what? We are really hoping to get a couple of calls from people who love live music and want to help us meet our goal in the late, great fall fundraising festival. We still have to make up a few bucks, and so we've got some great tickets and things like that. We're offering as thank you gifts for people that call us just during this hour that our show is on. I'll tell you what, we got one pair of uh, tickets for the Riverhawk Festival, but you got to pick them up here at the radio station. One pair of tickets and only one pair left for a $100 pledge to WMNF. If you can come down here and pick them up and pay your pledge, that would be really great. And uh, there's two in it. There's uh, an afternoon, a night, and two more days left to the festival, so it, it'll be great. We have a pair of single-day tickets to the festival for uh, an $80 pledge. We've also got a pair of tickets to Damien Rice, and that's coming up November 9th at Tampa Theater. Those tickets will be uh, will call, but that is a sold-out concert. You can get a pair of tickets to Damien Rice for an $80 pledge if you give us a call right now. And uh, those are will call tickets, but. Nobody else can get in because it's sold out. We've got one pair. And if you call us during the show here with an $80 pledge, you can grab those tickets. Also got a pair of tickets to the Slambovians tonight in Fogartyville for a $40 pledge and comes with an autographed CD. Wow. That's a great deal, huh? So somebody want to tell me where you came up with the name? And uh, it, it just seems to be a great name for what you, you all do and the way you look. <laughs> I just posted a picture of you all right here. And, and they could see us on the radio right yeah, these well, days. Well, it, soon. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, the name came, we, we, you know, we were in New York City. We were in New York City studio musicians that moved up river. We <laughs> moved to Sleepy Hollow, you know. Is that a real place? Up on the Hudson. Yeah. Oh man! And I was walk. I used to walk through the woods by the graveyard where all the Van Tassels are buried and stuff. You all know, from the from old the, aristocracy. Yes, all that stuff. And uh, the name Gandalf Murphy and the Slambovian Circus of Dreams, which was our kind of like our baptismal name that we shortened. 
right. was uh, just came to me in a flash. Okay. And I went back and told the band. I thought it was funny, and you know, I had written it down on my little index card, and they all loved it. And we tried it. Figured it would last a few months, you know, as a, <laughs> and it lasted our whole career. We were like very rich. How long ago was sports that? Sports cars and everything. That was a uh, man. Ninety-eight, maybe. Ninety-eight. Okay, wow. Seventeen. Yeah, we years survived ago. just doing this, you know. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, so you all tra- you travel all around? Yeah, that we do. We, we've been we've been on an endless tour. We do about two or three of the UK, and then we'll go to the west coast a little bit we're based you know still in right on the hudson in the hudson highlands now So you got right? a beautiful place to come back to there yeah we do that keeps us sane you know that really helps <laughs> we're in we're in the, in the mountains right on the hudson River. and he's not here today but he'll be there on the shows tonight and tomorrow it, it kicks a greater level of butt when the drummer's in the <laughs> all right let's have another tune if you please. So th- this is a song that's dedicated to people like Sid Barrett, who couldn't quite make it through the 60s. <laughs> uh, it's called Very Unusual Head. Got a very unusual head. He's got a very unusual head. They will take him apart when he's dead. And he's very unusual. Usual head. Cause he's sorry to poor and predictable games that they play with a glorious noise that can steal all our sad hearts away up through the atmosphere. Very unusual head. Got a very unusual head. They will take him apart when he's dead. And his very unusual head Yeah, they're following, swallowing Everything he's got to say But he's wallowing, hollow And barely can get through the day But he's coming back again Ducks in a row He's preambling, gambling This time the whole thing will go Straight through the atmosphere Got a very unusual head He's got a very unusual head they will take him apart when he's dead And his very unusual head Welcome into the live music showcase here on WMNF and from the Mike Eisenstadt Performance Studio. We're going to be playing you music for the next 55 minutes here, brought to you by WMNF. I'm Bill Dudley. I'm your host for the next uh, the next minutes. And today on the show, we got a great band. They're performing tonight and this weekend also. 
and I'll tell you all about that. They're the Slambovian Circus of Dreams. They were on our show one time before, way back a long time ago. And we're going to let them start off with a tune. What's this first one going to be, guys? This is called Lost Highway. Good luck, everybody. <laughs> up this morning, hit the high water mark, being tired of living in the fog and in the dark. I didn't go to work, I couldn't handle the jive, gotta find better reasons for staying alive. I So the Slambovian Circus of Dreams, our, our guests on today's show, and uh, we're going to let them do another tune. We'll come back and try to find out more about these these folks. Speaking of where we live, you know, we're, we're, we're right up the road where from where Pete Seeger used to live, so he used to pull us in to do all these fundraisers for the folk. Realm. God, I can I can just see that, Pete Seeger and you guys. I yeah, bet, I we bet fit he, very I well I bet he together. loved you guys. Yeah, yeah. We, we, we got along well, but we had to make sure we did enough, like, sissy folk songs so that they would hire us for the folk <laughs> festival. You mean, like, 500 miles? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you know, you know those. Avoiding things like Tom Dooley, which really caused a lot of uh, mental problems for kids, you know. But uh, we're going to do a, on the something on the sissy end, see if we could pull it off right now. Oh, is this Baby where you Jane. do Puff the Magic Dragon? No, no. Yes, it is. <laughs> Puff the Magic Dragon. Well, uh, Noel, Noel Paul Stuckey was here, and, Paul was he, here, right? and yeah. he made us all sing that. Did he? Good. On the air. I had to sing Puff the Magic Dragon. Good. We really love that song, even oh, though we I don't our like cooler that side song. doesn't let us get away with that <laughs> it's stuff. It's too but sad. It is very sad, isn't it? Yes, it is. Devastating. As most folk songs are, I find. <laughs> well, it reflects life, then. <laughs> this, one's, okay. this is a... Even our folk songs are kind of posery folk songs, so this is kind of like the singer-songwriter sensitive end of things. Anyway, this is another song that came down in one piece. We always dedicate it to the invincible spirit of women. It's called Baby Jane. See if we can play it. If not, we'll stop and do something more ham-fisted. Here we go. (laughs) 
Yeah, there are things they try to sell What they're worth I cannot tell We spend so much time Just surviving We let heaven go to hell You gotta move on, baby Jane The way they think will make you go insane They steal your love and then slam your name Well that's all right Cannot steal your light. Yeah, they can never steal your light. If you just move on, baby Jane. So move on, baby Jane. His face is strong, his words are sweet Specifically honed to knock you off your feet Yeah, knock you down there Hold you under Anything to keep you incomplete You gotta 